This is the user onboarding automation available through the Roost Crate Marketplace. This automation triggers from a form submission. When a form is submitted and the workflow is triggered, we'll initially go into the graph tenant to pull some environment information needed from graph. We'll create a ticket and assign it to Roost. We'll send an email for approval. Once the approver reviews the user information and clicks approve, the automation is told to move on to the next step. We'll then generate a random password, and with the password and form information, we can now create that user. If it's an Azure environment, we'll follow this path to create the user in Azure. If it's on-prem, we'll dynamically build a PowerShell script that will run through the RMM agent on the local AD server to create that user, add them to their groups, set up their home directory, and network drives. We have logic here for the Azure AD syncing. Once we see the user in Azure, we move on to licensing. The licenses are identified in the form, so if available in CSP, we'll go ahead and apply those licenses to the user. If not, we'll navigate into your distributor to purchase those licenses and then assign those to the user. Once the user has been licensed through this action, we'll add them to the rest of their resources, which include security groups, distribution groups, mail enable groups, shared calendars and mailboxes, SharePoint and OneDrive sites. We'll add them to documentation like Hoodoo or IT Glue, and then we'll add them to the PSA as a company contact. In the last section here, we'll document the time frame that it would typically take a technician to manually go through this process, and then we'll set the ticket status to reflect that the automation is complete and this workflow is done.